we're heading up to Michigan. We we have a little bit of business we got to do up there. But our son, oh my gosh, I almost turned the camera on <laughs> Bailey. <laughs> Bailey's like, let me alone. You guys, we just stopped and gave the dogs a chance to run. Here's Novi drinking some water. There's her water dish, baby. Giving them a little bit of time out here. Where are we, babe? We're about in Blytheville, Missouri. Where are we at, baby? Uh, yeah. Uh, Blytheville. Yeah, next to Blytheville. Highway. It's nice out here, guys. It's a little cooler than Texas. The girls getting something to drink. But uh, we've only stopped one time to grab a drink. Cup, don't, um, are you going to pour it back in the jug? Um, but anyways, just Joe's, um, Joe's, uh, mom had passed. So we just have to make sure we get up there and take care of some paperwork that he had to do. But also, um, we're, we wanted to go up to Michigan and support our son. Um, we just are asking for prayers as we travel, guys. Prayers as we are um, for my son. He's got a couple of big days ahead of him. And then uh, us while we travel. But it's really nice out, guys. It just feels weird not to be in the congested Austin. Here, put this baby on the jump it. Um, there are girls out here, guys. But anyways, you guys, um, I just wanted to bring you guys with us. What does it say? Thank you, babe. Um, yeah, we're kind of, and we're just going to go and come, you guys. We're actually only going to go up there, and then we plan to be back by, um, plan to be back. Baby, come. Uh, plan to be back by over the weekend. Um, we're going to see our grandson while we're there, too. Uh, where are we going? We're going to take them to the beaches. We're going everywhere free, guys. So, if you guys don't mind, we don't mind. But, um, we're going to go to the beaches. Um, we want to take you guys to the farmer's market. Um, Is that out there? Yeah, it's facing out there. Oh, okay. Hold on. Okay, there we go. Um, we're going to go to the farmer's market. We're going to take you guys to the beach. Um, where else, baby? I, would, I mean, Where's... ideally, we'd like to take you guys to eat some of our favorite places, but if we can't do that, we're going to take you guys to places other than that, like the Blueberry Fields, our farmer's market. We live in a kind of small town that it's a really cute farmer's market. Um, the Blueberry Farms, Strawberry Patches. Probably be going to Captain Sundays, at least. Yeah, at maybe we'll go to go Captain Sunday once or something like that. We don't know. Um, <laughs> you're minding your business, Novi. Come on, Mama. Um, but anyways... Um, we're definitely going to go see the Lake Michigan, the beaches over in Michigan. We miss them so much. I mean, Austin's great and everything. It's just Austin's very congested. And then all these, like, look at how many of these cars, yeah, you guys. Lake Michigan's beautiful, man. So beautiful. The sunset is, like, dreamy. It's, like, orange and sand. I mean, up in the UP, it would be great if we could just fill up our gas tank and go up to the UP. Yeah. I would love to take you guys to the UP. We just can't do that. Um, but we're, we're, it's okay because it's Holland's got uh, Muskegon, Lakeshore, all the Lakeshore, Saugatuck. Oh, it'd be great to take it to the drive in. Oh, yeah. oh man. The Getty Four, baby. Yeah. We're going to see where we can take you guys. Our main goal right now is just to get to Michigan. Um, we actually left last night. We were still up in the air about right here, babe. Um, you know, look at guys, the little baby girls. The little bitty baby. Um, why do people just leave their trash here? That just looks crazy. Um, we were just uh, 11 o'clock last night. We didn't even know for sure yet if we were going to go. And then it was like 12, 1230. And we're like, what are we going to do? We got, if we're going to go, we're going to go because we're going to need at least 18 hours, 24 hours to drive straight through. I mean, that's how our, my dad drove. My dad drove straight through. Um, when you drive to Texas, you go straight through. We don't even think about getting a hotel room or nothing like that. We hop in the truck and you drive straight through. You drive all night. Um, anyways, um, so at 11.30, Joe took a nap. About 10.30, Joe took a nap. And then about 1.30, he, 1 o'clock, he got up, 
uh, got the back ready for the girls. You guys, our little babies, you wanna see how our little girls are? They have the whole back. They have the whole back set up. Hey, right, sit down, guys. Novi sits up on that chair right there because she's cute. Boo, baby. Because she can't see outside otherwise. So she sits on that chair. And then they both, when they're taking a nap, they sit in the back seat. So they have it pretty luxurious. We have this so that way they don't lean on the on the truck because it's just a Joe's baby or whatever. Um, but anyways, we got in the car at 1.30, 2 o'clock in the morning. 2.30, right, babe? Yep. Then we drove through Dallas. Uh, just kept driving in Texarkana. We got through Texarkana this morning about 7 o'clock. And then um, Little Rock. Uh, Little Rock. And we're Memphis. through Memphis. And now and we're, we're on our way up to St. Louis. Yep. St. Louis. Just kidding. <laughs> I mean, it'd be nice. I mean, it's a lot on Joe's back, too. But we just got to get this done. Um, anyways, we're going to make, we're taking you guys with us. So uh, I hope you guys don't mind. But y'all are coming with it. Uh, coming with us. So we may, I want to still do the fried ice cream with my son. But you guys get to see my son, meet my son. And we're going to do the fried ice cream. And um, I want to do a couple of things with you guys. I mean, I would love to do some more. But. Um, but what our important thing is we're, when time comes, when mom time comes, we have to be there for our babies and I'm going to be there for my baby. That's a, it's a long feat, but, uh, I wouldn't, I wouldn't not do it for anything. If my son needs me to be here, guess what guys, I'm going to be here for my baby boo. Um, that's just what moms do. That's what moms do. We drive all night. <laughs> right, Joe? Yeah. That's what mom and dads do. We drive all night for our kids. Um, so anyways, guys, keep us in your prayers. If you guys could share, hit the like. If you're able to bless us, that'd be wonderful. Um, if you're not able to, just share and like. Um, otherwise, we will see you guys in Michigan. Um, well, we might stop one more time. Um, thank you so much, Commander, for dropping that. You guys send us an email, anything. I, I'm literally an open book. I don't mind. I mean, I don't mind telling you guys anything. Um, if you guys have extra questions you want to ask about cooking or whatever, um, you know what, you guys, the food thing, I want to show you guys. They have like gizzards and stuff in their um, fried foods. I got to put this so that way. Because yeah, Joe freaks out because they're going to hit our truck. I mean that the dogs are going to... Here, hold that, baby. Hey. Okay. Well, they're messing I put, there. I want to put the baby... Look, look you guys. Mess. Look at our little baby right here in the window. Can you see her silhouette? Because we put the chair for her to... Um, it's a foldable at the back. One seat can fold down. So my little Novi sits right there behind Mama's car. Okay. Um, I was, I was going to check the food real quick and see if they have the fried foods because i love a good truck stop that's just me y'all i'm sorry some of y'all don't like it but girl let me tell you i love like that fried okra oops they have fried okra in the back and they have gizzards i think those are i think those are i don't know what those are Oh, no, no, I'm good. Thank you for asking me, ma'am. Corn dog. Thank you. I mean, I'm still deciding. Who knows? I may need something. Fried pork chops. And... Oh, T. Kelly. Thank you for coming in. Anyways, those are the fish. But we are in... Uh, well, let's go look at the sign because we don't know where we is. Uh, Arizona, Arkansas, Missouri. I don't know where we are. I think we're in Missouri, y'all, because we're in Blythe, right by Blythe. We're right by Blythe, I believe. Anyways, we drove. Um, I don't. I. I mean, I would do it again. Um, we. We just literally, you guys, at eleven o'clock, we got off our live, and we're like, are we gonna go or not? Because it's gonna take us some time. Because sometimes Joe's back will be okay, and we can drive straight through daddy i'm up here oh, okay. and then uh sometimes he's like i can't drive i gotta give my back a rest so we don't know if it's gonna be like a three hour drive and then he's gonna have to give us back a rest or if it's gonna be a six hours or today he just happened to 
stopped for two hours. He slept and then just kept on driving. But um, we're going to get to Michigan. I would say by tonight it's supposed to be, but he might need to take some time off uh, before we get there. I'm um, like, uh, uh, I don't know. When you don't want I don't want you to push yourself. No. Sometimes Joe will get on like coffee and all of a sudden he'll be like wired. And I'm like, bro, you need to stop because you're about to have a heart attack. Um, but anyways, I think we might stop at about four or five just to give himself a rest. Give the dog some time to play outside and get loosened up and stuff. But we will be with you guys. We'll keep you guys with us because I really, I mean, I want to do the fried egg with or the fried um fried ice cream with um our son uh the alpha chef that's on there usually um we can do a couple of lives with my son and i mean it would just be kind of cool i mean that'd be cool i might get to see my grandson you guys okay calm down yvonne i get to see my grandson but anyways look at i don't know what side to look at i keep wanting to look there and it's over there let me help you oh no no once it's done it's done okay i love you guys and taking the milk. Girl, I don't drive. Joe drives all of it. My hands, I can't grip them. Look at how swollen. They get swollen up because of my RSD. Girl, if I took that drive. One time I drive Joe's truck and um, I went over the curb because it's a big truck. It's like a 3500. And I'm like driving and all of a sudden I was like. Kush! And I'm like, our truck is all sideways like this. And Joe wakes up and I'm like, bro, go back to bed. I don't need you up. You make me nervous and crap. The tires, it's just a bigger, it's a little bit bigger truck. So Joe thinks I can't handle it. So he tries to drive all of it instead. Anyways, um, we love you guys. We're going to keep you guys posted. We'll be in Chicago-ish by tonight, I would think. Right, Dad? I think so. And then he'll stay the Try. night. We'll, we'll probably, if we stay up, it'll be, then we don't, res like, I mean, we're not getting a hotel room or nothing. So he'll probably, we'll pull over and do a truck stop. Yes, in Jesus' name that he'll stay alert, that he stays cautious, that he just stays in tune. That's my, I mean, I try to stay awake with him as much as I can. <laughs> what is so funny, bro? How are you gonna just laugh? <laughs> Listen, I packed the truck while he was, I packed our clothes, I didn't pack the truck, while he was taking a nap. And then when he woke up from his nap, then he went and loaded up the truck and then I got the rest of our stuff together. <laughs> laughing because I, I was almost fell asleep and Joe's in the room sleeping and I'm like oh bro I'm going go there so so bad but anyways we got to get on the road um we're gonna go to Chicago and then from Chicago we're gonna see you guys in Michigan by morning morning or noon tomorrow afternoon for sure we're gonna go live and we're gonna take you guys down by the beaches and down by Colin by the parks and um Mijo comes tomorrow afternoon Mijo's coming tomorrow afternoon so we're excited for that but we'll be in our hometown tomorrow afternoon and we haven't um girl girl see she said the road makes me sleepy yeah we used to when we used to travel a lot i stay awake a lot, but i mean as soon as joe's backing out of the driveway because our home in michigan we'd be falling as i fall asleep backing out and then all of a sudden, um, we'd wake up and we're like getting off the exit in San Antonio when we lived down in San Antonio. And I was like, oh, we're already home? Like, bro, I literally slept for the whole travel. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Uh, but anyways. She slept for seven hours uh, at Tex uh, Arcana. I mean, we usually wake up for Bucky's because girl, those cinnamon rolls be calling my name. Um, so we will see you tomorrow. I'm probably going to go live tonight in Chicago. Um, and I don't know where we're going to stop or what we're going to do again, but I love truck stops. So take me with y'all. If y'all ever go to truck stops, take me with y'all. Like, go and show me all the stuff in there because I want to see them. Okay. We love you guys. See you later. We love you guys. Be blessed, y'all. Keep Joe in prayer. He's the one that stays awake for the long road the last Continue road. on West. You all are getting our directions. <laughs> Hey, Wandering. Um, we love you guys. Uh, we will see you guys shortly. We're going to go live in, in a couple hours. Tonight, or tonight, we'll probably go live. That's our sign.